Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So today I'm wanting to do a new home haul. If you didn't see my last video, you wouldn't know, but me and my fiance actually just closed on our brand new custom home. We've been in this process for over a year now. So as you can imagine, I've had a lot of time to do like window shopping, order stuff in, see what I really want. So I have a ton of things to show you guys, which I'm really excited about. I'm gonna break it up into a few different videos because there's just too much to share today. Um, today I'm actually gonna start with just like some essentials that I wanted, so like a KitchenAid, crock pot, and espresso machine, stuff like that. There's a lot of stuff that I actually already broke out and used, and then there's a lot of stuff that I also have not for the intention of this video. So without further ado, let's get on into the video. So the first thing I bought for the house, first thing ever, was actually Pura Air Fresheners. I've seen these sponsored all over Instagram, all over Facebook. When I first saw these, I thought they were so beautiful, such a cool concept. These are like smart air fresheners. You can control them from your phone. That way, let's say you go to work eight hours a day, it's not releasing scent while you're gone. So you can really maximize the product that's given. This is a gift pack. I actually bought five of these gift packs. I'll show you what they look like. So the gift pack comes with one of the diffusers that plug into the wall and then they come with two scents and I actually bought a ton of extra scents um, just so that it lasts me for a long time. All of these smell so amazing. I cannot wait to actually plug these into the wall. And the reason I actually thought this was a cute idea for myself, like a housewarming gift to myself, was because they had like a housewarming starter kit and look this one is literally called new home by homesick so such a cute idea i think it's a really good housewarming gift if you have a loved one that's buying a house or a couple that just got married they're moving in together such a cute concept this just plugs into the wall again you can get this synchronized to your phone and then you can release the scents however often you want to and you can even modify the intensity if you want it to be super strong or very subtle depending on what area of the room it is if it's your bathroom maybe have it stronger in the living room have it a little bit more mild that way it lasts longer oh and i will say these do magnetize and then this is a little light and it lights up when you plug it in so i'll see if i can show you guys all right guys, I'm not sure if you can tell, but it does have this little light, perfect for the nighttime. If you have these plugged into the hallway, it kind of illuminates your path. And look how pretty that looks on your wall. I love it. I would recommend this. I mean, I haven't used it yet, but the, sm the scents smell amazing. And again, it's a perfect starter gift. Even if you're not sure if you're gonna like it, just get one of those starter packs, see if you like the scents. I also wanna show you, I did truly buy five of these. This is what's inside. They all come with this little diffuser, two scents like I showed you in each one, and then I bought a bunch of extras. Next thing I got, I'm super excited for. This is something I have wanted for years and years, and one, my fiance, he actually got it to me for my birthday back in January, so about eight months ago as well, and I have been going crazy to finally unbox this, and he got me a Nespresso Vitro Next machine. I've actually already unboxed it, so I'll show you guys that in a second. Um, this is the box. It came just with the machine, and then he also got me a Nespresso milk frother as well. So I have already used both of these things. They look beautiful. And let me just walk you guys on over so you guys can see it. Okay guys, so this is what it looks like. Isn't it so pretty? I got the rose gold with matte black and then this little frother machine has its own little electric pad that it can sit on top of. It does make your milk froth either warm or cold. You just hold it down for two seconds for cold. And the quality of the coffee is amazing. It tastes so good. So I made coffee this morning, so when you open it up, it actually throws your pod in the trash can, and then over here in the back, it holds all of your pods, 
and the machine actually came with a bag to get rid of these that way you can recycle them so a very cool concept and then you just close it back up you can make your coffee you press the button and voila this thing also adjusts depending on the height of your coffee cup you need to make a little espresso or a full cup of coffee and yeah that's what it looks like the only thing i really don't like is how you can see the cords in the back cords drive me crazy so i still need to figure out a way to hide those or make those look a little bit better without it being too obvious okay guys so next up i got an echo show by alexa or amazon and then my Blink Mini. So I actually got these around Christmas time because they had a really good deal for them both. And I thought it would be perfect because I actually have a dog. He's a mini golden doodle. His name's Woody. And I wanted to have some kind of camera to be able to monitor, monitor him, especially, you know, these first few weeks, he's adjusting to a new environment. So I wanted to make sure that I could check up on him. So this camera I think is gonna be perfect and we'll be able to see him from our room or we can connect it to our phone. Um, we'll be able to monitor him. And I've actually had um, a few Echo Dots. I've had maybe two or three. I think I've had three. And then two of them have actually bit in the dust, which is probably my fault because I actually like listening to brown noise at night and I put it all the way on volume 10. So I think I probably um, busted the speaker. That's probably my bad, but I'm interested to see how I like this, especially with the screen. I think it'll be super cool, super modern, very sleek. I got it in the color white. Same thing with the camera. So if you guys have either of these, let me know how you like them, what you use them for, um, maybe some features that I think I sh that you guys think I should try out. And yeah, next thing that I got is really big, so I can't really carry it. But I got this Hearth in Hand with Magnolia Kitchen Aid. So it's the color green. One of my favorite colors ever is this color. So when I saw this, my mom actually got it for me got it for me as a Christmas gift last December. I'm so thankful for her. Thank you, mom, if you're watching this. Um, but she got me my favorite color KitchenAid. She saw me like fawning over it one time when we went to Target and she surprised me with it, which I'm super thankful because KitchenAids can be very expensive, but she knows that I love being in the kitchen, cooking, baking. Um, so staring at this for nine months has honestly just been heart-wrenching that I haven't been able to use it. So I'm really excited. To open it with you guys and show you guys what it looks like oh my gosh i'm so excited okay first thing i'm seeing is a card um collaboration with kitchen aid and joanna very cute and then another little card a big thank you card showing you all of the little attachments that kitchen aid has to offer and then I'll show you guys the top. Little sneak peek. Little instruction manual, I think. This is heavy. this is for if you guys know let me know looks some looks like some kind of pouring device and then we'll take off this little back piece oh my gosh two more attachments It's okay. 
It came with two more attachments. So it already has a whisk in the bowl, and then it has, I think this one is for dough, and then this one is like for standard mixing. Oh my gosh, look at how pretty that is. Okay guys, so this is the kitchen aid. I didn't plug it in or turn it on or anything yet, but I just wanted to show you guys the color. This is what it looks like. Isn't it so pretty? I love the color. Again, our kitchen is all white, so it does not like... Okay, guys. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a matte color. It's not shiny. Um, totally fits my aesthetic. And my kitchen is white, so it doesn't stand out too much, but I also love the little pop of color with it. It's like a very subtle, muted pop of color. So I did wanna just say again, the KitchenAid did come with three attachments. It came with this, or it came with four attachments total. It came with this little mixer, and then a dough kneader, and then whatever this is. Again, I'm so not sure, I'll have to do some research. And then it also, you can see it set up in the back already, um, but it also came with the whisk attachment already hooked on. Okay guys, so we are getting down to the last couple items for me to share with you guys today. Um, this one I'm very excited about. My mom also got this one for me for Christmas last year. Again, so thankful for her and anyone who's given us anything. But this is a crock pot. So pretty. And this one actually comes with two crocks. So it comes with the regular standard bowl and then it comes with one that has like the double bowl. Um, so super perfect, funny story. I'll tell you guys while I open this up. So funny story about the crock pot. I actually had one um, from my old house and I ended up taking it to my mom's house and I used it. So we moved with my mom around this time, like September, August. And then around the holidays and like when it got cold, I made a lot of soup. Um, so I used it very frequently. And then on Christmas, my mom ended me ended up getting me a new crock pot because the old one that I had, it was the first one I had ever used and it was also stainless steel, just the one with one bowl. And I didn't know that you couldn't get it wet. So I accidentally got like the outside um, silver part of it wet and it started getting water spots, some rust spots. And I had only at that point had it for one year. So my mom kind of heard me tell Juan that I wanted to get a new one because I didn't want that one to come to this house because it just didn't look good. Um, so my mom surprised me with this crock pot on Christmas day. And then later that same day, my brother ended up coming over for Christmas, like opening gifts, Christmas dinner. And I went to go grab something out of the garage. We had put my crock pot in there to make some space for some more of the dishes. And I ended up moving a box in the garage to grab something. And my old crock pot, the one that I was using at my mom's house, actually fell and the top of it shattered. So it was kind of funny how my mom got us a brand new one the same day that our old one shattered and she got it for us before the fact. So, so thankful that we have one now that soup season is right around the corner. Ooh, so this one's the double crock. It's definitely not as deep as like the standard size, which it's probably because this is for like dips and stuff, not something that you need a whole lot of. And it's perfect because you can probably store them still in the same place. So that's the first one. And then this is like the standard crock. Just black, ceramic, so beautiful, so clean. And let's see if they do fit inside of each other. Yeah, so this one still fits for storage. You can put one on top of the other. Um, 
and it's nice and neat. And then lastly, we have the actual device that does not need to get wet. You can adjust the temperature, turn it on, off, keep it on warm mode. So we have the crop pot, the lid, and then we have the two separate crops. Okay guys, so last but certainly not least, I got the Caraway Pot and Pan Set. This is something that I also saw sponsored a lot um, by some of my favorite influencers I saw on Instagram, social media, and I fell in love. I love the sleek, minimal design. I love the colors. So I snagged it up. I kind of made a mental note that I wanted to buy it brand new when I got the house. Um, so I snagged this up. I actually used to um, i love them all like if i could have them all i definitely would um but i started off with the white and gold set originally i wanted it was like a white and silver and they came out with a new color um or they came out like with a new collection it's like a gold collection at crate and barrel and when i saw that oh my gosh guys i about lost my mind I think I bought them that same day. I got these a little bit early, not as early as some of the other stuff that I got, but I had to get these as soon as I saw them because I wasn't sure like if they would sell out and they wouldn't bring them back. So when I saw the gold, I had to get it. So it comes with lid. All of the pots and pans come with lid, and they also come with a little organizer for the side of your um, cabinets. So they're all covered right now. They have a little protective sleeve, that way they don't get scratched in transit. Oh my gosh, I have not seen these yet because I kept them in the box, but this is what one of the lids look like. It's just a cream color with gold detailing. The bottom is gray covered, probably it's like the non-stick. And then it has a little hole for steam while you're cooking something hot, or if you're cooking it hot. This is what the lids look like in their little storage container. So genius. I don't know how more pot and pan companies are not doing this, but that's so genius. That way your lids are nice and organized, your pots and pans. Oh, we haven't even gotten to the pots and pans. Let's move on. But this is genius. I love how it comes with the hooks that you need to hang it on the inside of your cabinet doors. And then each piece has a spot. So they'll stay nice and tidy. They won't get scratched. Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. Look at that. That is beautiful. Little sneak peek on the action. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. So this is the pot. Again, same non-stick interior, creamy exterior with the nice little silver bottom for the heat. And then the gold detail. Oh my gosh. I almost don't even want to use it because I don't want to mess it up, but I'm sure these work marvelous. If you guys have never heard of Caraway, um, I'd kind of be surprised because I have seen this advertised all over and they, as they should, this is amazing. And then each pot and pan comes with its own wrap. So, I'll show you kind of, I'll show you guys at the end what it looks like in my cabinets, but this is genius. I cannot stop doing it on. Okay, so got the pot. And then, oops. Ooh, little tree. Let's see what that is. All right, this is the non-stick skillet, again, with the same gold detail non-stick interior and creamy color. I love it. Look, this is the size of my hand compared to the pan. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look so pretty in the kitchen. And again, they all come with their own little rack. 
That way you can store them perfectly in your cabinets. And then here's this fry pan, the smaller fry pan. I'll show you guys in comparison the size difference. So one is definitely smaller than the other. So pretty. I cannot, oh, okay, and this one doesn't have the handle on yet. I don't know if you can tell, one of them does, one of them doesn't. But I cannot tell you, so these, I will say, they are pretty heavy. They feel like amazing quality, but still usable. Like, they don't feel like I can't carry it by myself. Um, I love the handles. They're gold, but they're kind of muted. They're not like that yellowy gold. I love the muted, like, dusty gold kind of matte so pretty and that one also came with its own little container that one also came with its own little rack as they all do and then the last pot that we have in here is the saucepan. So again, very sleek, very beautiful. It has a nice deep interior with the same gold finish. I cannot get over how beautiful these are. Again, this one came with its own. This one came with its own little carrier. I don't know if you guys saw, but earlier there was a little box that popped up. Oh my gosh, guys, that was incredible. I just cannot stop staring at how beautiful these pots and pans are. I love the color that I picked out. They look beautifully in my kitchen. I'll definitely make sure to film what they look like um, in real use, or at least in my cabinets, that way you guys can see or compare like to the colors you have. There was one more little goodie in here. Oh, it says that more goodies inside. Um, one more little goodie in here, which I think I know what they are. Um, it was tucked in pretty well and it just popped out but oh yes they come with little uh, pot coasters it's so pretty I love the packaging it comes with a little caraway bow it's like a little cork that way you can set your hot pan on the on your cabinet or on your countertop without it making rings all over it. Make sure you follow my Instagram down below. It's VC Spot, V C S S P O T. Um, and I'm sure I'll keep you guys updated on my Instagram as well. Um, Okay guys, so I wanted to show you the whole setup. So as you can see, everything has its own place down to the lids. Every pot or pan has a compartment so it's nice and organized. It stays nice and clean, there's no scratches. And I wanted to show you how it looks like when it's in my cabinets. It fits so perfectly, it looks beautiful. I can reach for whatever I want instead of everything being stacked upon each other and making a whole ton of noise. I can just grab it and take it out. Okay guys, so if the storage was not innovative enough as it was, I actually just noticed that the storage mechanisms actually are magnetized. So, oh my gosh, that's so cool. So it's literally as organized as can be and compact. That's amazing. 
So they don't just slide around, they literally magnetize together. And you're good to go, that's awesome. Okay guys, and that's actually it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you subscribe down below, I'd really appreciate it. I'll also make sure to link down everything that I mentioned in today's video, in case you guys are interested, if there's anything that you fell in love with, just like I did. Um, yeah, leave me a comment down below what your favorite item is that I mentioned, or if you have anything that I mentioned. Um, if you like it, maybe any tips or advice. Um, but yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!